Hi, Tony Bearer. I woke up Saturday morning very depressed. I was just really depressed. I went on Facebook and I saw the picture that and video that Adamation's sister posted. It was very depressing to see Adamation in a coffin. It's like 9 11. We knew the trade buildings were down, but until I went to uh, ground zero, I saw for myself they were actually down. But uh, it was devastating. This uh, video is a uh, dedication to Mr. Adamation and his family. His sister did a great job putting it all together. And uh, I went to Venice Beach yesterday and talked to all his friends, all the uh, street performers that miss and love animation. Devastating, I almost had a drink yesterday. I'm two and a half months sober. It was really a uh, depression day for me. But thank God I didn't have a drink. I went to A this morning, feeling a little bit better. But I hope this video helps the family that he's, uh, he's missed. He's gonna join uh, Otto Peterson, a great ventriloquist who passed away a few years ago. He's gonna join Albanone, a great comedian. He's gonna join Charlie Barnett, uh, outstanding comedian. He's gonna join Rick Avelius, another great, great comedian in heaven. And hopefully when I go to heaven, I'm gonna join the guys and we can have a, a damn good time. I know he's up there. I know he's up there showing the angels how to break dance and uh, do a lot of comedy. So this video is to Adam's family and his fans. I hope you enjoy it. And uh, thank you for the video and the pictures. And uh, it was like we were there. I wish I could have been there, Mr. Chad. Uh, changed the juggler wanted to go a few weeks ago, uh, but he couldn't make it and he was driving. My money's kind of short right now, so I couldn't make it to the funeral. I wish I was there, but uh, I was there with the photos and the pictures. So thank you for the pictures and the video. It was like we were there. Enough talking now. Here's the video. Oh, I've been waiting for you. How you doing? How you doing today? Well, today, today's animation's uh, funeral today. Oh, today? Yeah, so I interviewed everybody except you. I've been waiting on you to uh, talk about animation, Mr. Animation. Wow, Mr. Animation. Yeah. It was, it was you, me, uh, uh, Michael Callier, uh Robert Greenberg, we all work with this guy. That's right, yeah. Top of the line, man. Yeah. I mean, we talking about the OG animations being there since I've been here. And um, I had the opportunity to share the stage with him. Well, you're the godfather, you know, of the. Uh, well, he was the enforcer. Yeah, the enforcer, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's true, yeah. We could call it an animation anytime he likes to show up, like, okay, man, listen, yeah, man, you know true. what I mean? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And, yeah. But, man, that, that hit me so hard, I mean, you know you're here today and you're gone tomorrow. Yeah. But the way it happened, um, it's still in my head. But um, rest in peace. And uh, oh, what I learned to do now, I ride my bike on the sidewalk. Oh yeah, that's true. That's I'm not like, see, my bike is on me over there, but yeah. I'm on the sidewalk. I'm, I don't want to go to the street. I have a scooter. I give it away. Yeah. Because the way these cars be going, everybody's trying to hustle to make the money, and cab drivers always on the phone. You understand? Yeah, or taxi. Taxi. They're always on the phone. I don't care. They said, stay off your phone. They're always on the phone trying to, hey, did you call for a taxi? Okay, and I got you. Oh, that's true. That. Yeah. Yes, yeah. you know what I mean? Yeah. And like the police said to me, it only takes a second. That's why I always keep my over here clear in case they got to go through. I got you. You know what I mean? Yeah. One second, and 
I mean, you hit a man that hard that he's at a life today. Yeah, because he was uh, on his bachelor going to Vegas at night, and a cab driver uh, hit him. That's what I'm saying. So your cab driver, he was. He, I mean, I, I could see somebody get hit and get up, but, but the man dead. Yeah, they said that the cab hit him and he went 100 feet. Yeah, the cab, the cab driver wasn't paying attention. So what's your what's your best moment with animation? My best moment. Uh, well, man, there were so many good times that yeah. we had together. You know what I mean? But um, when we went to City Hall to talk about the space, yeah. yeah, he got up and he said, listen, you guys don't know what's going on on Venice Beach. But you in your office. But why don't you just come to the beach, buy yourself a pizza, walk around, yeah, and, I remember that. and look and see what's going on. Yeah, remember that? Because, yeah, because they sit down there and they make decisions. Yeah. They don't know what's going on here. No. We're fighting, so we don't have to fight with the people here. Yeah. And he was there, he was there, he get up on stage and he tell them like it is, you know what I mean? Um, but um, we work here together. Yeah. We share this spot. You know, we do we shows, whatever. Um, I went to the department with him one time. You know, I didn't work, but um, it's just that he's a good person, man. Yeah. He's a good man. You know what I mean? I, in fact, I look at the book, the, um, Fantasy Island. Yeah. With him. Remember that? Yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? So, all I can say, man, rest in peace, my brother. And we're going to just keep it rolling. And with an animation, we'll see you up there, me and Hoover. Yeah, well, we're coming. Not, not right away, but we'll be there. Yeah, we're coming. We're coming. You, you won't be alone. Yeah. We're coming. You know, it's not, it's not that you, he, he leave us. Yeah. He just, right now, he just go going quicker. to different, yeah. But hey, we come in, we all going to be there together. You might end up doing shows too. You know what I mean? Yes. You, yeah. I, I like to say, we going to heaven. Thank you, Huber. Hey, welcome to Venice. Tony Rivera. Peace out on that one, man. Uh, today, today is animation funeral today. Oh yeah. yeah. So, so what are your thoughts on animation? Animation was fantastic. He was a genius in his own right, undiscovered. Because no one really took good films of him. Brilliant. Yeah. The way that he used masks and recordings to create a show. He had people carrying him, even in Santa Monica Promenade, everywhere he went. They carried them on his ha on yeah. their hands. We were so excited about his performance. And you were saying, and you were saying the other day he was too young to pass. He was too young. Way too young. He's only in his 40s at the prime of life. Yeah. Strong, strong individual. He brought himself through a hard life and delivered to everyone a fantastic performance. But he'll never die, right? His soul will always yeah, be here. I just wish there were more videos of him. Me too. People have the memory, the video that will never pass. And, and the video from eternity, here it is. And thank you for doing this. I know you never do stuff like this, man. Thank you, thank you, I owe you one. Thank you. Hey, Raymond, how you doing? Hey, hey, Tony. All right, just want, just want to show you guys really quick. Uh huh, yeah. Hey, hey, you do this for animation? Yeah, today's is a uh, burial today. Okay, thank you, yeah. For real? Yeah, for real. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, he was, a, he was a great man. Yeah, man. Animation, as respect, I gotta take off my shades for that, so people can see my eyes. Animation was a great man. I mean, you know, usually when you come to a new place, as entertainers, you don't see out of eye to eye. But when things make sense, you know, we come like this, brothers. And yes, he gonna always, he gonna be well missed. But the memories that I know about animation, the great man that I'm talking about, will always be in my mind. And you know, I mean, as respect to see, excuse me. Yeah, I can hear you in the conversation. Yeah. So as respect to animation, you know, and he, he passed it on to the younger generation too because the younger ones have respect for animation. You got, you got new animation? Of course. Uh, uh, what's, your, what's, what's your best moment with animation? I'm going to miss animations, his energy, man, his, his character, his rawness, you know what I mean? Like, he always was that, he had that raw L.A gangster vibe, but he was like family to us. He was like our big uncle, you know what I mean? He taught us a lot how to street perform, and he taught us just a lot, man, life, you know what I mean? Like, so, rest in peace animation, man. That shit hurts my heart to even talk about it, bro. Yeah. And you're, and you're sir? Um, I'm Nugget, man. I came out here a few years back. I got to be animation out here in the streets. He even gave me inspiration one of the three shows out here, watching his shows out here. He was the first guy I see have like like a thousand people wrapped around him. And how old were you then when you first saw him? Um, I was about 26. Wow. I'm 33 now. So he's one of the inspirations that he even wanted me to be in out here on Venice Beach. Thank you, sir. And you're, and you're us, sir? 
Animation. Animation. Today's is uh, today's is burial. Uh -huh. Oh, and okay, animation, yes. Uh, geez, I don't know, when I first came out here, that's one of the first guys I seen. Uh, pretty crazy that one guy can uh, command an entire crowd, so that's like, that was re very, very impressive. And then, you know, as the years went on, I kind of, I've kind of picked up a few pointers from him, and you know, like kind of, we kind of really structured the show to to how he used to do it. Yeah. And it's, it's helped us out a lot, and you know, and with that being said, like, this show is actually a piece of him, so you know it, it carries on in tradition and it passes on to the next. So I, I can honestly say, without him, like who would have known to think of the format that we do now? Right. So big up animation, man. Rest in peace, brother. Thank you. And he, he also did shows with us. You know, oh, he did. That's great. A few That's times. great. Uh, when we didn't have like a grand finale, he was the grand finale. Wow. So yeah, big ups, man. Pretty sad day today because today they're gonna bury him in uh, Vegas today. Oh. Yeah. Actually, it's going on right now. I know, like I really wish, I, re I really wanted to be there because I thought it was a while ago that he was buried. Yeah, me too. I wanted to go there too, but they kept, they kept, they kept uh, postponing it. Yeah, so, I mean, if I could be there, I would definitely Okay, thank you, sir. Uh, sir, do you have anything to say about animation? Yeah, rest in peace animation. Animation was one of the people who I know who street performs, like as you're seeing, as you're recording us right now, like we're about to street perform, but at an age where he let me know where anything is possible. You could still just keep going, keep fighting. Don't stop, you know what I mean? Cause I'm 24 right now. And sometimes it's too much for me, you know what I mean? Coming out here every day. So to see him at his age and he's out there and weather like this, sun like this and dancing, you know, is motivation. He worked, he worked in the rain too, you know? I know, yeah. I definitely know. Yeah. Trust me, leave. Yeah. I know. Yeah. I know, don't get me wrong, but I'm talking about, cause I, I street perform, yeah. you know what I mean? So, I look at him from, from what I know, you know what I mean? And that shit is just, it's just crazy, like, you know what I mean? Like, how it happened and to see somebody like that go, it's like, you know what I mean, I really hurts. Well, he never die, he'll always be, he'll That's, always be alive. He's here right yeah. now, you know what yeah. I mean? His energy lives through us, he lives yeah. through everything. You know what I mean? That's the best part about it, man. Definitely. Yeah, you're right. And everything, everything is energy. Look at over here. Yeah, I work. My, my experience of decades on the street, knowing Tony, you know, great entertainers like Tony, Varys, Uba Uba, and Charlie Burnett, and Albert. Albert Owens. Yeah, man, you don't say. You know, everybody have different energy. And me coming from the Caribbean, so I admire those people and animation. Did, did, uh, did you know Otto and George, the, the ventriloquist? Uh, I, well, I heard about I, I, in faces. Yeah, he passed. He passed all about yeah, yeah, five years ago. To, yeah, yeah, as respect to you know old timers like them. Yeah, they're gonna live on through me. So yes, animation gonna be well missed, and you know it's we just have to stay positive and the stuff that he taught us, so that you, you get older and your mind elevate to another level of you. So yes, bless animation. Well, you're a legend on your own, by the way. Well, coming from you, I'm not a legend that I look up to. You know, I respect to you. you well, know? I'm an old guy. I had to retire. Yeah, you know? but with me, it seem uh, you're still young, real young, because I can Get see one, the Tony that Send I first came Thanks, in Appreciate Washington it. Square Park. Your good old days. Yeah, yeah, man. Good memories of us. So you guys are great and everything, and this, this is going. This is going to be going online. I didn't get you. I didn't know animation like that. I met him one time at the promenade, and I seen him doing, you know, an animated show. You know, he had character, you know, I seen the, the struggle in his dance, you know? Yeah. That's all I really remember him for, you know? But I was glad that I was able to meet him. Coming from New York, I got my own OGs, and to see everybody hurt, you know, from, from him passing away, you know what I'm saying? It's like, somebody like if Wayne Blizz, you know, or, Spivey or somebody like that from Brooklyn in New York, I feel the same way, you know, so I feel like, hey, you know, that's the best piece of animation. Well, thank you, man. I, I owe you one. Thank you. Okay, thank you. You guys have a blessed day today, and you guys pray today for animation, all right? Thank you. Peace animation. We love you, bro. You're always going to live with us, man. And your name, sir? B-Boy Flea Rocks. Gil Method, Street Masters, Miami, Florida. Been doing it since 1992. First time I saw animation was in Radio Tron, 1996. Wow. With, uh, with Air Force crew. Hey, thank you, sir. Since I was a kid, I've been watching him. Then I got to meet him. I've done shows with him. We've hit together. We've done shows out here together. Animation knows me. We know each other. Everybody knows that. So. Perfect. Love you, man. Thank you. Uh, we get there, bro.
he was in Sir. puppy snow too. Did I get you he yet? Didn't, he didn't reach his 60, that's like a puppy. Uh, uh, today's uh, animation is uh, burial today. And I want to get your thoughts on animation. Word, um, personally, I've never met Mr. Animation, but I know he's a big influence to everybody around me right now. And he's taught a lot, you know, so peace and respect to him. I know he's very dope and raw, and uh, his energy will stay alive out here in the streets. Okay, thank you for your time, sir. Uh, did you talk yet? You want to talk? Uh, sir, your, your thoughts, can you come over here? Get the background. Your thoughts on the uh, incredible animation? Um, I first met Mr. Animation about about seven years ago on the promenade. I actually, I, my mom, like, when I was little, she used to take me over there uh, a lot. How old were you? Um, I was around like five. Okay. And I seen him in Thriller when I was little and, and like, and then growing up, like going to high school over there and seeing him, like I had just started dancing, so he showed me like a lot of the essence, the true essence of popping and and locking and hitting and the funk of it and everything. And and when I heard about him passing, it was just it was just real hard to believe because I know he had his struggles and everything. Yeah, he did. But yeah. I, I, we all do. I, yeah, we yeah we all do. But I, I just don't think he deserved. I don't think he deserved to go like that and I don't really I don't be, I don't believe it was his time to go yet but he left a lot of wonderful memories amazing memories behind I was actually in his show a couple of times he's taught me some stuff he's he's one of one of my OGs and and I have a lot of respect and a lot of love for him so I send my prayers my condolences to his, him, his family and 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 like it's just real it's just real sad to hear him to hear that he that he's gone but his mem his 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 love and energy will always live on forever. and he will live on to you guys too yeah you know like, he, he'll always be always. up here and, and in here because he's left a lot of happy memories with with us especially and he always he always encouraged encouraged the youth to dance more and be more uplifting and outgoing and stuff because I, I'm I, I think he loved to see that from something that he was doing since he was a teenager. Yeah. It going on 30 to 40 years later and it's still having an impact on the youth and everything. So I will always, whenever I'm popping, he's one of the people that I always remember in my head, how how animated he was and how how much of a character he was and everything, and how funny he was. And his uh, showmanship was really amazing. Yes, and also, and then another thing, to be at his age and still be able to do the things that he do is, is amazing and, and encouraging and inspirational because, I mean, that just proves to show you that one black don't crack and if you stay, if you stay fit and just keep yourself young, you you always, the age won't matter, it's all, it's all about how you feel. And your name, sir? My name is Manny. Thank you for your time. Yeah, thank you. Okay.